Hello there, this is Derek again and welcome back to the channel. So in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you top 5 Android apps which you need to have on your Android devices this month. And if you're new here, consider subscribing so that you don't miss these kind of videos in the months that are going to follow. And without further ado, let's just dive into the video. So the first app I want to share with you is called Remove BG. So with Remove BG, you are entitled to remove the background of any photo you have or any picture you feel like you want to just take off the background this app is going to do it right away for you you are entitled to just do this with some simple steps which you are going to go to your gallery by tapping on upload an image and then you go to the gallery and then you tap on probably maybe the picture you feel like you want to just remove the background with a little while the background of this picture is actually going to be taken away when you tap on the original you're going to see the picture like this and when you tap on the remove background you're going to see the background be removed if you are content with whatever you've gotten or whatever background you've had you are entitled to just tap on download right here which is actually going to download it when you choose to download in hd you are supposed to sign up before you're going to be able to download in hd you can press on this edit sign right here and then you scroll up to just get other backgrounds which is going to fit your picture very well so you can check out like this and play around with any of the background to feel like you want which is pretty much very very cool so if you're that person who's always been trying or thinking of how to just change the background of your photo or maybe take off the background of your photo with remove bg you are entitled to just do this with ease and you don't need any photoshop or illustrator techniques to just do this you just do this with a simple click so let's check out the next app the next app on the list i want to share with you is called retroport with retroport it makes your phone look like ipod classic ready when you check out my device this is my Google Pixel 3 XL but looks like an iPod Classic and all the buttons right here just feels like iPod Classic when you just scroll through you can feel it very very well the vibration in it is very very slick like an iPod Classic you are entitled to just go to the music right here create a playlist right here and then you are entitled to just put in any song you feel like you want which is cool you scroll down like this and then you're gonna get your songs right here and you can just scroll through like this and it will just change any song you feel like you want and that is pretty much very very cool you can even move forward to just change the display or the way you feel like you want this player to look like you can just change it like that and that is very cool so when you change that right here you go premium and then you're going to be able to just get other colors right here too but if you want to just get this normal colors you stick to the white or you stick to the black which is the two default ones that are free and that is pretty much very cool you can even move forward to just change the display colors if that you want it dim or you want it light and then go for it to just change the color of the wheel too either you want it white or you want it on gray or you want it red you can just pay it for a cool amount of money and you get a red wheel too which is pretty much very cool the wheel style too depends on however you feel like you want it you can just get it like this if you want it this way or you can just change it to buttons provided how you feel like you want it you can just change it that way and that is basically very cool so retroport is one of the music players i'm going to recommend to you guys which is actually going to give you the feel of the ipod classic you used to have and that is basically very very cool when you tap on the music player and you try playing any song it just looks still like the ipod classic which is very very cool so you try retroport if you feel this app is very helpful for you and let's check out the next app so the next on the list is called volume booster good eve so this application is one of the coolest apps so far as we are talking about music players right here and i think this application is one of the kind we need to have on our devices so most often you can have some music or some songs that are not really loud and with this app right here it's gonna boost the sound of the song you have actually downloaded and that is pretty much very cool the way this works is so so much cool that it's very very unbearable that it's even sometimes not understanding when you tune your song to the lowest volume even you're gonna hear everything so i'm gonna do a test with a song which i don't think i'm gonna get copyrighted and we are going to see how loud the song is going to be even per how we've just tuned this volume very very low we are still going to get a chance to hear everything that is playing on the background or that is playing from our phone and that is pretty much very cool so this is one of the apps i think you guys should just try to or get on your devices which is going to be very helpful for you so let's check out this song right here you see the the song is very low but we can hear it right here you check out right here when I just change it like this you can feel how loud it is so I'm going to leave the volume like this and I'm just going to go to the application and then tune it a bit louder and then we are going to see how loud it's going to be so I've, I've kept it on 45 and then we are going to see let's go to the song and then we are going to feel how it's loud it's going to be so I'll pop it and then you're going to see look at the volume so you see the volume right here 
but it makes it sound very very loud and that is pretty much very cool i'm sorry if the song was too loud i'm sorry i'm going to leave the link of the song in my description if you feel you want to download it you check it out and that is basically very cool so we're going to check out the next application so the next app on the list which i want to share with you is called wi-fi man so with Wi-Fi Man, that is one of the cool apps too. I found it very helpful, which I think sharing with you is going to be very, very nice too. And with this one, you can test how fast your Wi-Fi is when you check out right here. I've already run some tests and it has showed me the speed of my Wi-Fi right here. That is pretty much very, very cool. It shows you the internet connections you have right here when you check out plus the phone that is connected to the Wi-Fi too right here. And the Wi-Fi name, everything shows right here. And that is basically very cool. So when you tap on start speed test, it's going to test how fast the Wi-Fi is and you're going to see if your Wi-Fi is very fast or not. So that is pretty much very, very cool. This doesn't take much minutes. It just takes a few minutes and then you are good. So let's check out the status option too right here. And then you're going to see the service provider of your internet right here, which is kind of limited. But the Wi-Fi I'm using, this is very correct right here. And then the phone I'm using too is a Google Pixel 3 XL and you can check out the Android version too, I'm using is Android 12 and that is pretty much very cool. So this gives you an intact detail about whatever your phone is using. And when it's up on wireless right here, it's actually going to give you the number of devices connected to the Wi-Fi, which is pretty much very cool. I think that is one of the coolest things I liked too. And when you tap on it, you can just see how it moves and then the manufacturer of your router and everything. And that is pretty much very, very cool. You tap on discovery right here and you're going to see the number of devices or the devices that are connected to your wi-fi right away and that is pretty much very cool i think there is one thing missing right here if maybe they make a sign up on this application and maybe being the owner of the wi-fi you can just choose to just manage the people you've connected to your wi-fi right away and i think that is going to be very very helpful so i think maybe if the developer is actually going to see this video i think it's going to be something we need to consider and that is going to be very helpful for us so let's check out the next application so the next app i want to share with you is called stoki with another 12 coming to us I think it's time for us to just get applications which are going to share with us very cool wallpapers and that is pretty much very very okay with us so with this one it gives you the wallpaper of most phones right here so when you check out right you can see google pixel you can see s9 galaxy google pixel 3a and then galaxy 10 ios 13 and then samsung galaxy fold it goes on and on and on and so that is pretty much very cool you can go to random and then you're going to get other random wallpapers too like xiaomi hana and then a lot of them you can just look through with color OS coming through too and also with this wallpaper too it's gonna help us get the dynamic colors right here so when you check out this wallpaper that is the one i'm using currently check out my home screen you can see right here stoki just help me got this wallpaper right here and that is pretty much very cool so when you check out right here and i tap like this side you're gonna see the dynamic colors are here you can see right here too everything right on my screen picks up the material you if i go to my wallpapers and then just switch on the themed icon it's just gonna change everything right here and you're gonna see the material you theming popping up very very cool making it very very nice so this is one of the cool apps i think is gonna be very helpful for us and also with stoki you can just create a gradient for yourself by tapping on create gradient and then you can just tap on this side and it's gonna shuffle anything you feel like you want the background is just gonna change however way you feel you want to see it you are going to be able to just shuffle all right here and after you're done you just tap on this section apply and then you're going to be able to just apply it as your home screen or your lock screen if you don't want to apply you can just tap on this one to just save it right away and that is pretty much very cool if in case maybe you don't like to just get a shuffle button too you can just tap on this section and then you can tweak the toggles right here and then you're going to get your pictures like how you feel like you want to see them and that is pretty much very cool so Stokey is one of the coolest things you're going to get or one of the coolest apps you're going to be able to use or set as your wallpaper. So if this video was very helpful, just give it a thumbs up so that it reaches a lot of people. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel because I'll be bringing to you more new apps every month. And check out this video if you feel you want to know more about Android 12. And without further ado, I'm just going to catch you in the next video. Peace.